It's your boy, Mark Gray, chilling at Morgan State University's Hill Field House, the house that Nat Frazier built, but Todd Bozeman now owns. I'm chilling, and I came to find if the Bears are ready to awaken from a 30-year-plus championship slumber. Stay with us. It's Around the Way with Mark Gray. We're coming at you next. The bare facts are this season is that nothing has come easy for Morgan State to this point, but they still find themselves tied for second place in the MEAC. But with talented players like number 32 Marquise Cately and number 4 Bubakar Coley, this is probably the most talent that Morgan has sent to the floor since the 1974 team that featured the human eraser Marvin Webster. And second-year coach Todd Bozeman is doing more than just winning games in Northeast Baltimore. He's trying to change the culture to compete for an MEAC championship. And our consistency and our focus and our effort. If we do that, then, I mean, it's, it's, uh, it's, uh, we, we, have a, we give ourselves a chance. If we do that, we give ourselves, we give ourselves a chance. And that's all I want to do. Be consistent. And when I say consistent and focused, that's when we come to practice. Same thing. When we warm up, same thing. When we come to games, same thing. And warm up in the games, warm up in the pra- uh, 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 when we play in the games, same thing. If we're consistent in our effort and our focus, we, we give ourselves a chance. And that's all you want to do is give yourself a chance. Bubakar Coley was the first impact player Bozeman landed when he took the job. The Xavier transfer, who's battled injuries through his career, is a MEAC Player of the Year candidate, averaging a double-double. And after last year's trip to the semifinals of the MEAC tournament, he's got his eyes on the championship ring. We became a team really early this year, you know, that's the difference. And, you know, we all know what our objective is, you know, our main, our main objective is to make the NCAA tournament. And everybody is buying into it, and that's what makes it really easy. Caitly was an all-freshman Pac-10 selection at Cal Berkeley before transferring to Morgan and was forced to play the point when the injuries hit early this season. With the team still trying to find its rhythm, they're looking to gel by March. We're going to take a step forward. We're going to learn. Just learn, you know what I'm saying, more from every game. So we're going to get better. The Bears have talent. They have size. They have depth. They have all the ingredients necessary to win a championship. And you know, if they're playing this well come March, We'll be around the way in Raleigh as they cut down the championship nets. I'm Mark Gray. That's what's happening around the way this week.